kids of Hope, good morning. It's story time and today's story is focusing about patient, love, and understanding. Our story for today titled The Wooden Bowl. A frail old man went to live with his son, daughter-in-law, and a four-year-old grandson. The man's hand trembled, with his eyesight was blurred, and his step faltered. The family ate together at the table. But the elderly grandfather shake his hands and failing sight made eating difficult. Peas rolled off his spoon onto the floor when he grasped the glass milk spilled on the tablecloth. The son and daughter-in-law became irritated with the mess. We must do something about grandfather, said the son. I've had enough of his spilled milk, noisy eating, and food on the floor. So the husband and wife set a small table in the corner. There, grandfather ate alone, while the rest of the family enjoyed the dinner. Since grandfather had broken a dish or two, his food was served in a wooden bowl. When the family glanced in grandfather's direction, sometimes he had a tears in his eyes as he sat alone. Still, the only words the couple had for him were sharp admonitions when he chopped a fork or a spilled food. The four-year-old watched it all in silence. One evening before supper, the father noticed his son playing with the wood scraps on the floor. He asked the child, sweetly, what are you making? The boy responded, Oh, I am making a little bowl for you and mama to eat your food from when I grow up. The four-year-old smiled and went back to work. The words so struck the parents so they were speechless. Then tears started to stream their own cheeks. Though no words were spoken, both knew what must be done. That evening, the husband took grandfather's hand and gently led him back to the family table. For the remainder of his days, he ate every meal with the family and for some reason, neither Husband nor wife seemed to care any longer when a fork was dropped, milk spilled, or the tablecloth was soiled. Kids of Hope, the scriptures teaches us that God is patient with us, His children, the Lord is compassionate and gracious slow to anger, abounding in love. The Lord is not slow in keeping His promise, as some understand slowness. Instead, He is patient with you, not wanting anyone to perish, but everyone to come to repentance. Be completely humbled and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. For ye have need of patience, that after ye have done the will of God, ye might receive the promise. Therefore, 
as God chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourself with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience.